Right, morning people. Hope everyone's had a good night's sleep. It is 7 a.m. I'm about to leave to go and clean a roof, steam clean a roof day. It's quite a big one as well. It's a really cool house, so I hope you guys will enjoy this video. Thanks for all the love on the last video as well. You guys seem to really enjoy it. So yeah, I will see you guys at the job. Right then guys, we are here at the job. Check this out. Lovely little, well, not little, lovely cool house, I guess, on its own. Nice bit of land with it, which is really cool. Super mossy though. Obviously a tree here is probably one of our big culprit culprits. These things are gonna be a little bit awkward, but the house is quite short, so it shouldn't be too much of a hassle. That garage did really bad as well. A nice peaceful garden as well. Look at these trees. I'd love a place like this, I really would. And then the back, just as mossy as well. So yeah, it's gonna be a bit of a messy day, to be honest, probably two days, to be fair, to get this done. We'll see though, I have got both the machines here today, so we will see how it goes. I'm just waiting for Kev to turn up. Oh, here he is right now, there he is. And uh, we will begin, so I hope you guys enjoy this video. It should be a nice transformation. I don't know what color these tiles are gonna be. Um, I actually have no idea, so we'll find out together. Right, let's get set up. <laughs> Right, oh, that got written is completely loose. That's interesting. Guess we just take that off and out. Oh, he's got a broken clip, that's why. Yeah, these gutter ends can be a nightmare, folks. Obviously, you always want to disconnect them, especially when there's this much moss on the roof because they're just going to block up. Make your day, oh, that one's easy. Make your day really difficult. And you don't want, uh, you don't, you know, you can get a blockage here and that's fine because you can clear that easy. But when you start getting blockages down here, or even worse, into the ground, that's when you're going to have a massive problem. So yeah, always take these off. Let it run for it. it causes a big mess, but we can clean up a mess easy enough. That's your camera there, mate. Let's oh, have that set up up there, just on time lapses. Right then, that's set up done pretty well for me anyway, because I've still got to build the scaffolding up. I'm just gonna start here, work my way around, I think. Um, and we'll finish on the back later on today.
Right then folks, progress, the front is done. The time is 1.48, it's actually taken ages to be honest, a lot longer than I thought it would have. But there we go. How nice is that look? Kev's just finishing off the garage now. Um, what a difference, eh? I really wasn't sure what colour it would be, and when I started I was like, oh, it's a bit grey, but wasn't too sure how nice it would turn out, but it actually looks lovely, doesn't it? Still needs a bit of a rinse down, because where I've blown back over, it's got some crap. See, there's some of the moss hanging down there, but yeah, I'm really pleased with that. It looks really nice. It's time to get onto the back, so I think this will be a little bit easier, to be honest. There's like one less apex at the front, so I'm just going to set my tower up there, do that bit, tower there, do that bit. See if I can get to this middle part, or whatever, today, and then tomorrow I can just finish off the end, and then it will be job done. Um, so yeah, I'm actually feeling it today. I'm pretty tired, but on we push.
Okie dokie guys, day one done. I've just got that hard bit around that thingy there because that'll be, I'll be dreading it in the morning for whatever reason. It's just a bit awkward. And that's the roof, so done pretty well there. There should only be a few hours of cleaning. Well, not even that, probably an hour of cleaning tomorrow, hour and a half maybe, and it's all done. Right then folks, quick intermission break. We are off to, me and Lydia are off to the hospital now to have a scan. First scan for another little baby. So this will be baby number three. So I'll let you guys know when we're out because we're not allowed to film in there. Um, we won't be able to see if it's a boy or a girl yet, but it's just to make sure everything's okay. So fingers crossed and I'll see you in a second. Check that out guys. Look at that little guy or girl. I think it's a guy. I think it's a little dude. All looks healthy, all looks well, measurements are all good. We're actually further along than expected as well, so end of September, the baby should be here. Okay, so just pulled back up to the job. It's looking nice, this roof is. Um, yeah, gosh, that's a weight off my mind, guys. Um, it's always a bit scary with babies and stuff, like that first scan, because you just don't know. Um, but she said everything looked pretty good, everything looked great, so... Phew. Right, it's real now. I don't really let it get real in my head until then, but yeah. Exciting times, baby number three. So if you don't know, I've already got two little girls, Aurora and Nova, they are four and two. Um, so it'll be a third one added to the clan, which is cool. Um, and it's nice, I mean, I know you guys don't realize it, but just to each and every one of you just clicking on and watching these videos when they pop up, that directly helps my children's future in a sense. Um, Cause obviously we do get paid by YouTube as well. So the more helps, you know, the more views help and stuff. And it's, it's really nice that it's become such a big part of my life and it's, it helps us, you know, go on holidays and helps me save for a house and things like that, which is awesome. So yeah, right, anyway, let's get back to work. It's a lovely sunny day today and all I've got left to do is just that. So big bit there, easy bit there that I can do from the ground. Um, I'll show you the front now. We just swept this up into piles yesterday. Sorry, I didn't show the clean up. My batteries were running a bit low. Um, but yeah, we just thought sweep it up into piles, let the water drain out of it. I don't usually like leaving any mess at the customer's house, even if I'm going to be here on a second day. Um, but I made sure to rinse all the walls down everything, so that won't be a problem today. But I thought that'll do. I don't think they mind anyway. We've got a nice skip here to dump the moss in as well, which is great. So yeah, we had a casualty on that roof there. There was quite a few loose tiles on this one. I presume it's just branches that have fell and cracked a few of the tiles over time. So yeah, we'll sort a tile out for them there and get a new one put in for them. It's quite an easy fix, to be honest. Literally, you just lift the tiles above it and they slot straight in. Um, and yeah, check this out, all nice and dried out now. It's a completely different house, isn't it? It really is. Remember on day one how dark and moody it looked? And now it's like a summery, nice, smart house. Right, let's get set up and go. Okay, all set up, ready to go. That literally took me about five minutes. What's the saying? Proper preparation prevents piss poor performance so i think that's it anyway i think i got that right right to you let's set you up let's get this job done and dusted
Right then, folks, that's a wrap. Uh, there's the front as well. Looking all lovely. Kev's just spraying away now, getting the bicycle on the roof. Watch it. All right, mate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, chill, man, having a watch. So we're just spraying that on there now, make sure that's all nice and foamed up. It's looking good to me. Bit of an awkward reach to get to, but uh, he'll figure it out, he'll manage. He always does. Right now, folks, that's it from me. So um, I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm not sure what I'm doing yet. I need to check my list tonight. But I've got a couple of schools that are coming up as well. They will be in the Easter holidays, which is next week. So I think I've got two or three schools to do next week. So there should be some fun videos there. Um, and then, yeah, just a whole host of other jobs to get to. So, well, the folks, thank you for watching. All the best. Take care. See you soon.